JavaScript and Selenese parameters. JavaScript and Selenese. JavaScript can be used with two types of Selenese parameters. Script. Non-script, usually expressions. To access or manipulate a test case, variable inside the JavaScript snippet used as a Selenese parameter. All variables created in test case are stored in a JavaScript associative array. An associative array has string indexes rather than sequential numeric indexes. JavaScript with script parameters. Several Selenese commands specify a script parameter including assert evil, verify evil, store evil, and wait for evil. These parameters require no special syntax. A Selenium IDE user would simply place a snippet of JavaScript code into the appropriate field, normally the target field. JavaScript with non-script parameters. JavaScript can also be used to help generate values for parameters, even when the parameter is not specified to be of type script. But, special syntax is required the JavaScript snippet must be enclosed inside curly braces and preceded by the label JavaScript, as for example, JavaScript asterisk your code here asterisk. Echo, the Selenese print command. Selenium echo command. Selenium's echo command allows you to print text to test's output. This is useful for providing informational progress notes in test which display on the console as test is running. These notes also can be used to provide context within test result reports, which can be useful for finding where a defect exists on a page in the event test finds a problem. Echo statements can be used to print the contents of Selenium variables.